Julia. Welcome back, everyone. Okay, Michael Galena was most recently nominated for Best Chef in America Midwest by the James Beard Foundation. And with his wife, Tara, because you know there's always a woman Thank you. involved in this, too. <laughs> this year has consistently been awarded top tier awards locally and nationally. And we're so happy to have you join us this thank morning. Oh, thank we're you so much. We're so happy to be yes. here. Yes. And um, I had to ask you before, how do you pronounce it? Everyone asks. Visia. Yes. And what is, what's the meaning behind that? So it's Latin and in English it means vetch and vetch is a cover crop that farmers grow to keep the soil healthy. So mm -hmm. it just puts, puts nutrients in, helps kind of restore to us. That really symbolizes good farming, which means good food, which is what we like to serve at the restaurant. Okay, I've been there. Tracy is moved I have not, down. but I will tell you, We're ready it's one of the most whenever. recommended restaurants oh, to me. So I, I keep a that. list of suggestions. Awesome. So. Yes. But what should I get? What is the dish? Uh, everything. If I'm gonna well, everything. <laughs> oh, no, I mean, we, we change it, yeah, yeah, we change it so often, it's hard to tell. What is my first impression? The Farmer's Feast, I think, is a great way to experience the restaurant okay, right now. We do a tasting menu and a Farmer's Feast. Farmer's Feast is basically a compilation of all the stuff off the a la carte menu or the taste menu where you just come in and let us cook you look let us cook for you for the night oh you know i can do that yeah, yeah i can do that five course so i love the name yeah, yeah. Great. tracy yeah. we'll have to do a dinner yeah yes a feast uh, yeah <laughs> a feast now i i love that you are a vegetable forward restaurant I would say, what does that mean? But I, I know what that means, but yeah, explain I, but to I our think, viewers. You know, it's important to, I think, clarify that it's not vegetarian, right? Mm -hmm. um, but really for us, it's about using great local ingredients, which mm -hmm. oftentimes here in the Midwest, we have an abundance of amazing produce. We so so do. we really like to just kind of put the vegetables at the star uh, mm -hmm. and make them exciting and interesting. Yeah. We serve, I would say probably our most popular dish, if you do come in, is our turnip shell tacos. Um, so we use the turnip oh. shells as tortillas, which is a little bit of a different spin. How clever. Um, but it's so fun and it's something that people don't, I mean, what do you do with, you know, there's only so many things you yeah. can do with turnips. Yeah. Right. The menu is basically just a celebration of what we get from the farmers each day. So we just try to have fun with whatever comes in, and mm -hmm. that's what goes on the menu. Okay. Well, there is meat, but vegetables too. Yes. Okay, you have this cute, this is the cutest little yeah. thing. Yeah. So, I, know. I love this. Okay, so. We'll do a little swap you out here. Are, yeah. You are open for lunch on Saturdays. Kind of brunch. Is it brunch, lunch? We, it's lunch. I mean, lunch. It's, yeah, it's still kind of our, our same lunch menu, and we just kind of occasionally we'll do a couple specials. Uh, one like being, because we're all uh -huh. bleeding blue today, right? The, Yes, yes. So we are. <laughs> we've got a, a cast iron pancake that I, I, you know, my daughter kind of in, inspired me to make just because mm -hmm. I never wanted to make a pancake at my restaurant before, but because <laughs> but of her, daughter has we, changed we've started doing so. it. So, um, yeah, we just basically make this cast iron pancake. So it's not your traditional pancake, but it's nice and fluffy and delicious. And we bake we it in the oven versus cooking. Yeah, we oh. bake it. Um, it basically takes start a while with then, butter. doesn't it? Yeah, it's, it takes about 10 or 15 minutes. Okay. And then pull it out and just cover it with uh, preserved blueberries from last season. This um, is the secret ingredient, though. So it is it is maple syrup, but uh -huh. we melt the butter into the syrup so that you get Ooh, the butter in every bite, which, you know, is the secret, I think, to a great pancake. I have so many questions, <laughs> but we only have, like, a minute and a half. You guys work together? Mm-hmm. You play together, you have a daughter, you have dogs. How do you make it all happen, seeing each other 24-7? Some days I'm not sure, you know, but um, no. I mean, I think, you know, we have we met working together, so this has always sort of been our dynamic in life, is, mm -hmm. is kind of being passionate about food and, and providing great hospitality, and, and that allowed us to build this restaurant, and now with a family, it's it's definitely harder, and every day is, is, is kind of a how do we make this all happen, but right. um, we both love what we do, and, and I think that really makes it. Yeah, and it's amazing sure. to me, you've only been open a couple, less than two years, really. Yeah, we just passed our two years uh, in March. And you won all these awards and food and wine. And is the pressure on, though, to keep that momentum? I think the biggest pressure is just keeping our customers happy. Like, mm -hmm. all the other stuff's an added, you know, bonus. But, you know, do we just work hard every single day to, to keep everybody that comes into the restaurant to eat, you know, hopefully wanting to come back. Michael? and Tara Galena. We have to have you back. Yes, okay. yes, and yeah. the pancake we do at lunch uh, on and Saturdays only. So okay. definitely recommend coming down and checking it out on All Saturdays. Right. Absolutely. And if you'd like to visit Visia, <laughs> it is located at 4260 Forest Park Avenue or you can visit viciarestaurant.com. It's V-I-C-I-A. You guys are lovely. Thank you. Oh, thank, you. Thank, you so much. Yes. thank you so much and we'll be right back.